Welcome to the Austrian German tutorial. In this tutorial, we learn the ordinal numbers in Austrian German. In general, ordinal numbers can be translated as Ordinalzahlen or Ordnungszahlen. This video deals with the first 10 ordinal numbers and you will find out what erste, fünfte or zehnte means. First, Let's start with the intro. The learning goal of this Austrian German tutorial is to learn the first 10 ordinal numbers in Austrian German. As I've mentioned before, ordinal numbers are called Ordinalzahlen or Warnungszahlen in German. The good thing for learners is that they are very similar in Austrian German and in Standard German. First things first, therefore we start with first. If we use first for a numbered list, we say erstens, erstens. If we use it with articles without nouns, it goes like this, der erste, die erste, Das Erste. And in dialects of Austrian German, you often hear the following. Da Erste, die Erste, sie Erste. This goes especially for the spoken form. In written form, we always stick to standard German. If we use it with nouns, we use small letters. For example, when it comes to months. The 1st of January is Der erste Jänner. Der erste Jänner. Second. For numbered lists. Second means zweitens. Zweitens. With articles. Der zweite. Die zweite. Das zweite. In spoken Austrian German, you often hear the following forms. Da zweite. Die zweite. Das zweite. With months, February 2nd is der zweite Februar, der zweite Februar. Third, for numbered lists, third means drittens, drittens. With articles, again the same, der dritte, die dritte, das dritte. In Austrian German, you often come across Der dritte, die dritte, das dritte. With months, for example, the third of March is der dritte März, der dritte März. Fourth, for numbered lists, fourth is viertens, viertens. When we use articles, der vierte, die vierte, das vierte. In Austrian German, der vierte, die vierte, das vierte. With months, for instance, the 4th of April, der vierte April, der vierte April. Fifth, for numbered lists, fifth means fünftens, fünftens. With articles, der fünfte, Die fünfte, das fünfte. In Austrian German dialects. Der fünfte, die fünfte, das fünfte. When we take a look at months, the 5th of May is der fünfte May, der fünfte May. Sixth, on our lists, sixth means sextens, sextens. When we use articles, der sechste, die sechste, das sechste. In Austrian German, you often come across der sechste, die sechste, sechste. When we're talking about months, for example, the 6th of June, der sechste Juni, der sechste Juni. Seventh, for numbered lists, seventh means Siebtens, siebtens. With articles, 
der siebte, die siebte, das siebte. In Austrian German, der siebte, die siebte, siebte. And if you want to talk about the months, the 7th of July, der siebte Juli, der siebte Juli. 8th, for numbered lists, 8th is achtens, achtens. When we use articles, der achte, die achte, das achte. In Austrian German, it's a little bit different. You may hear versions like der Ochte, die Ochte, das Ochte. With months, the 8th of August, der 8. August, or der 8. August. 9th, for numbered lists, 9th means 9ths, 9ths. And the articles, der 9. die 9. das 9. And in dialects, der 9. die 9. das 9. And for the months, for the months, we choose September. The 9th of September is the 9. September. The 9. September. 10th, for numbered lists, 10th means 10. Zehntens. If we want to use articles, der 10. die 10. das 10. And in Austrian German, we often use der 10. die 10. das 10. We take a look at October. For example, the 10th of October is der 10. Oktober. Der 10. Oktober. Let's repeat the ordinal numbers for numbered lists once more. Erstens, zweitens, drittens, viertens, fünftens, sechstens, siebtens, achtens, neuntens, zehntens. I hope I could show you some important ordinal numbers in Austrian German and in Standard German. If you want to find out more about Austrian German, I could recommend the playlist How to Understand Austrians. Thanks a lot for watching the Austrian German tutorial. Have a nice day. See you in the next video. Auf Wiedersehen und Servus.